Hi everyone, welcome back to the my channel. My name is Anil, and in this React Native video, we will learn about the external style sheet. So these are the points that we are going to going to cover. So first of all, we will see that what is the external style sheet, then how we can use it. For that, we have to make a new file and we have to import it and the apply it. So guys, if you want to watch the video about the internal and in the, uh, and inline style sheet, then link is given in the description box. So now. What is the external style sheet? So when you just write your complete style in a separate file rather than a same file where you just write the code for uh, with tags and text and view, all right. So this is a basically external style sheet and why this is important. So when you just want to apply your same style on a different screens. So let's say your uh, button of your complete website have a same style. Then why do you have to write the same button style on the every component? Then you just have to put on a separate file and you have to apply on a all screen from the same from the same file and it have a one more benefit so let's say uh, you just want to change the background color of your application or a button style so then you need to just change on a one place so if you just put your button style in every file then you have to change it on a hundreds of file or maybe on more than it right so the same style should be in a external style sheet or a separate file so uh, now let's uh, move to the code and first of all uh, i i'm just going to want to show this all complete in the app.js because this is the initial file and this is our previous file code so i'm just going to remove it so that uh, you can just get it from a very scratch so let's remove the whole code so i'm just going to take a new text box for text here and just write here external style so now you will see this this is a very small and tiny uh, text so we will just uh, uh, beautify it with the external style sheet so first of all i'm just going to make a new file which is the style uh, it's actually a folder then inside it you can just make a one more file like external style dot js right so here i am just going to import uh, something from react native and something means style sheet right that's great and now we have to export default this component right or you can see the address file and uh, now just take a const and const name name can be same as a file if you just want to do otherwise you can just put different also and here uh, let's use the style sheet dot create function and this function will accept an object so let's say i just want to make a one object like text style all right and you can just simply write some style here like color can be green and font size can be 60 right so now we have to import it here so let's we don't need this style sheet here just import external style from style folder and external style sheet file and now just use it with your text where you where you just want to use so let's uh, take a new line so just write here style and here you can simply write here external style sheet dot uh, text style and let's see now you can see that um, so I think there is something wrong uh, let me check I think this is the yeah, actually, I just need to use a small t here so that uh, it looks good. All right. So now let's. Uh, mm, I have to just save it also. So now I I have one more object, or in a web language you can see that you, uh, we have one more class like text bg. Then how we can apply it? For that, let's take a comma here and use the background color property and here we can use like 
red and let's import it also uh, you can use it an, as an array or just use mm, external style sheet dot bg color now you can see that we got the background color here also so the benefit of using the two class is that and if you just want to apply the background color on a sing only single place then you can like use like this like and uh, you can just simply write here more right so this is whole about that how you can use external steel style sheet if you still have any kind of issue or any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video